What's going on, everybody? Uh, just to give you a heads up, there's really no major purpose for this <laughs> video. Just kind of a a small ramble, if you will. I don't know if I've ever done a ramble uh, in the, I guess, what is it, about the past nine months that I've been making videos. I don't think I've ever done a ramble. <clears throat> but I was just out here sitting on the porch, smoking my pipe and uh, watching some videos. Just got inspired by Nate and Rachel to make a video. I don't know why. Just watching one of their videos and thought, hey, I'll just... I'll make a video and talk for a minute, just because I haven't been able to do it lately. Um, I guess there's no better time than to show you my new pipe. It's a GBD Constitution. Nice little pipe that I got on uh, got on the eBay. Sweet little pipe. It's actually smaller than what I expected, but man, it, it it's really light, so it hangs pretty nicely. Um, I guess, uh, I'd give a couple shout outs. Angela, if you see this, uh, we're really praying for your niece, Trinity. Um, mentioned it to Leslie the other day, and that's just, uh, heart it's heartbreaking for a child to be sick. Uh, if you didn't know, Angela's, uh, I think, I believe it's her great niece, Trinity, had, uh, pneumonia or, or, uh, something in uh, in the hospital and just just having a lot of problems and I got to thinking about my my three-year-old and how hard it would be for us to handle or for me to handle that uh, you never want to see a, a small a small child sick or um, struggling with health or whatever and uh, especially if it's your own or even if it's your family you don't want to see that so Angela and Eric uh, just to let you know that you got at least me and, and Leslie praying for you guys and praying for Trinity and hoping everything goes smoothly. Um, hope to ha hear an update sometime soon. Uh, I know I texted uh, Angela the other night just to let her know we were praying for him. So um, hope everything goes well with that. So uh, let's see what else. Oh, I am smoking. Man's best friend from everybody's favorite tobacco supplier. Absolutely. It's funny to see uh, everybody smoking Sutliff private stock tobaccos just because, um, you know, either you got a bunch in Nashville or you're on the Yahoo. Uh, I know Rachel's in the Yahoo Women's Pipe Club or whatever, and they send her a bunch. Or uh, I think Skipsy the other day got a, a shirt from Chris and and those guys from Southern Fried Pipe Club and. I think he sent her some salt with private stock tobacco. It's funny to watch uh, watch videos or look on Instagram and seeing everybody smoking salt with blends because it's like they're trying to get rid of it all. But I don't know. I mean, I, I, I like I enjoy some of it. There's some of them I really don't care for. Um, here recently, I know when I first started, um, I guess, branching out my uh, my choices of tobacco, I knew salt have they've got like a, a million different types and I was trying a bunch of them, and they were really some that I really, uh, really I liked, and uh, really couldn't find any that I didn't like. But now that I've started kind of narrowing down my taste, I found some that really aren't that great. Um, but it is what it is. You know how it is. You find a you find a blend that you don't really like, and uh, but anyway, this uh, man's best friend is pretty good. Um, oh, not that bad. It's got a cute little dog on there. Um, says it never bites so I haven't had it bite yet but, um actually what else oh this is a shirt from work uh, we do a United Way campaign every year I mean, this is an old shirt but uh, at work we do a United Way campaign where uh, employees donate money and uh, we do a lot of fundraisers well, we had a, a golf tournament the other day and uh, my team we did not finish last, I'll say that. If you know anything about golf, um, when you have a four-man best ball or captain's choice tournament, usually uh, it's fairly easy to shoot about five or six or maybe ten or whatever under par. Well, we shot par. So I say we didn't place last, but we tied 
for the highest score. So <laughs> we didn't come in last, but we tied for last, if that makes sense. We shot a 71, which was par on that, that particular course. I think the winning, uh, winning team shot a 58. So they were 13 under par. But anyway, it was a good, we had a good time, good weather. Um, of course, any reason to get out on the golf course and play some golf is, is uh, you know, it's fun for me. So, um, let's see, what else? Oh, um, Denali Dave, I hope everything's going well. If you see this video, I hope everything's going well with uh, after your surgery and, and um, you know, whatever's going on with your legs. Um, all else fails, cut them suckers off and get you some wooden legs. Then you just have to call a termite inspector every once in a while. So. Yeah, now I'm just being dumb. So, but anyway, uh, been a good weekend. My Clemson Tigers lost yesterday. Got demolished by uh, the Florida State Seminoles. That was not fun to go to, but I uh, can't win them all. So, anyway, hope you guys are having a great weekend. I hope you guys have a great week. Um, I guess that's it. Just wanted to ramble on for a minute. You guys have a great time uh, over the week when you go back to work, uh, or if you're on, uh, if you're in school or whatever it is. Speaking of school, shout out to Peterson. Peter, hope you're having a great week at school, or I hope you have a great week at school. Um, I don't know. Just somebody I wanted to say hey to uh, Silver Shadow. Hey. Hmm. I guess that's about it. There's a million other people I want to say hey to, but I can't think of everyone right now. So you guys take it easy. Love you guys. Later.